Hello, my name is David McCarty and I'm the Service Director here at Night Office Solutions. Today I'm going to show you how to clear up streaks, lines, and marks on your mid-volume sharp, color, and black and white copiers. The first problem we'll look at are lines that stop just short of either edge of the paper. The problem is often caused by dirty scan glass. To check your scan glass, lift the document feeder and place your lined document in the upper left-hand corner of the platen glass. Check to see if the lines coincide with a mark on the scanning glass. We recommend using a lint-free cloth and a bit of alcohol to clean the glass. If you notice lines on the second side of a copy, lift the document feeder and press the tab at the top left corner to reveal the second scanning lens. Clean the lens and close the white cushion. Next, we'll look at the problem of dots on your copies. This is often caused by marks on your main copy glass. Like before, clean the glass with lint-free cloth and a bit of alcohol to remove any dirt, streaks, pen marks, or whiteout. Then, lower the document feeder. If the lines on your copies extend all the way from edge to edge of the paper, you may be having a problem with engine lines. To fix this issue, open up the front panel of the copier and remove the waste toner cartridge. After placing it to the side, you should notice a green cleaning wand located on the drum unit. Grab the end of the wand and pull it out and push it back in two to three times. For a color device, remove the green cleaning tool seated on the back of the front cover and insert it into the four cleaning ports located on each drum unit. After you finish the cleaning process, return the green wand to its holder. If you are experiencing void lines on your copies, there's a laser glass cleaning tool located next to the green wand. Remove the tool and insert it in the corresponding access ports under each drum unit. Slide it back and forth two to three times. When you're done, place it back inside the front cover. Go ahead and replace the waste toner cartridge by pressing on both sides of the bottle and close the front panel. Thanks for watching this video. We hope that you found it helpful and that you'll come back whenever you have routine maintenance questions. If you have an issue that isn't covered in one of our videos, feel free to give us a call and one of Knight's experienced technicians will help get you back up and running in no time.